Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It is Tuesday morning, and if you're new here, my name is Tracy. I do all the things lazy keto, dirty keto, whatever you want to call it. And I also do a little bit of hauls and cleaning videos, vlogs, um, just a little bit of everything. So I've got a grocery haul for you, so if that's something you're interested in, then stick around. So, I got some things from Kroger and mostly Target, and my kitchen is currently a disaster. I have pulled everything out of my pantry, and I'm cleaning it all out, and I'm going to put down some, like, shelf liner stuff and get everything put back in there. So, right now, everything is out on the counter, so it's a disaster. But anyways, I'll show you what I got. Most of it's keto. There's a couple of not keto things in there that I got for the kids but just wanted to give you a little warning about that. Target had the insane meat stuff going on, so I got a ton of stuff to put in my freezer. Like, I got this big pack of pork chops, and it had $5 off, and I think it was $9.99, so it was $5 after that. And I got this boneless ham, and it was $8, and it was had a $5 off, so it was $3. I got a couple of limes and a lemon. I'm going to try to start putting those in my water and drinking to try to get away from the artificial sweetener kind of water things. And I got some coffee. I got these were, I think, $5 and something before. So they came out to be like $2 for hamburger patties. And I thought that'd be good just to have in the freezer. I got this ground pork was like $4.29. So it came up to be $1.29. And I thought that'd be good to make some meatballs. I use ground beef and pork in my meatballs. So I thought that'd be good. I got a head of lettuce. And some strawberries. Some green beans celery. I got a giant thing of Pirate's Booty for the kids. Let's see. Also got some broccoli. I got some of these uh, Dr. Zevia to try. And I went ahead and put one in the refrigerator to get cold so I could try it out. I've never had them. I got three of these. These were $8.19 and then $5 off. So $3.19 for three pounds of ground beef. So I got three of those. So I got nine pounds of ground beef and it was just a little over a dollar a pound. I saw I was getting all the meat stuff and so I wanna make sure I have plenty of freezer bags cause I couldn't remember. I got this was $5.99 and $3 off. So it was $3 for beef shaved steak. And I've got that before, and it's really good to make, like, a Philly steak sandwich. And I got four packs of this chicken. This was so cheap for boneless chicken. Like, this pack was $6.05 and $5 off, so it was $1.05. And, like, that one's $1.59. I got several of them. They come out to be, like, a dollar a pack, about. Like, that one's $0.99. Cents. And I'm gonna put all that in the freezer and that will last us a while. So that's all my food stuff and I'm gonna put this cold stuff away and then I'll be back and I'll show you what I plan on cooking this week. Here's this week, I've got planned to have breakfast, steak and grilled zucchini, chicken pot pie that night. I'll probably just have one of my things that I meal prepped, it's in the freezer turkey, broccoli, and cheese. I've got that turkey breast. I'm just gonna throw that in the oven. That should be good. And ranch chicken and Parmesan cream spinach. The ranch chicken is a recipe I've made before, but I'm gonna try to make it keto for myself as well with some almond flour and stuff. So hopefully it'll turn out good, but we'll see how it goes. So that's pretty much what I got and what I plan on cooking for dinners this week. And hopefully I can do a couple of cooking videos. Right now I am in the middle of trying to get my kitchen turned back around. 
and I'm about to work on this pantry. You see I've got all my stuff taken out and I'm putting down shelf liner paper. So maybe I'll show you how it looks whenever it gets all done. But that's it for this video and I hope you liked it and you're subscribed and I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys.